We start in the trenches in 1917, which you might not expect from reading the book. Uh, there's a lot of action in the play, as well as emotional uh, connection, emotional turmoil as well. The story is about a woman called Connie who marries into this uh, sort of very higher, upper class family. Um, and then her marriage changes dramatically because of something that happens in the war and her husband is paralysed. She's finding her life a bit stifling and society a bit boring and a bit bourgeois and so she starts an affair with the gamekeeper on the estate um, who sort of offers her something completely different. This is all a constant reminder of how the, the war affected everybody's life, um, not just those men who served but those people who were at home as well like Lady Chatterley. It's very emotionally driven, it's about connection to other human beings it's actually a play about hope and about honesty, so I think people will enjoy that. I hope audiences are completely blown away by it. I, I hope that they like, feel exhausted at, at the end, like they've been through something quite intense. I like that it has moments of lightness and humour, and I think that really makes the moments of darkness and um, emotion even more felt and have even more depth. If you've read the book or seen an adaptation, I would come and see this version because I think it will surprise you.